Hey YouTube, Model Train 9500. Um, let's see here. This video is about Walther's uh, Gold Line, their Beth Gone Coal, their uh, their HO scale, and here's the box. There you go. Um, as you can see, it's Walther's uh, right there. Superbly detailed, detailed plastic kits, not kits. Uh, yeah, kits. And uh, here I got the Beth Gone six pack, the NSF. Um, let's see, I got these uh, Walthers. They're on sale this December. They were like sixty bucks. So um, those are them. And here's a close up of them. On the ends here, they got uh, Proto two thousand. Well, not, I don't know what kind of couplers. They're like uh, Walthers, some kind of special. I don't know. They're regular spring couplers. But then on the uh, ends here, they have some other kind of coupler. I don't know exactly what it is. There's no spring in it, and the little knuckle doesn't move at all. But they ha and they just slide on top of each other. But I haven't had a problem with them at all yet, and I don't imagine I will. Uh, the paint on it is pretty nice. Lettering's crisp and. Also, if you notice the numbers right there, uh, that one's 668525. Uh, the other ones are f all different numbers. Uh, let's see here. They, they're kind of, they're shiny, and I guess that's how they're supposed to look. So that's kind of nice. Um, let's see. Oh, on the top here, they have some kind of detail in there, which is pretty nice. It's not just a regular strut, it's, um, I guess, detailed to what the real ones would look like. And we got the brake wheels in there. I see the couplers. And then the regular uh, knuckle coupler on the end here. Um, they have hidden weight somewhere in them. Like, there, there's some good weight to it. The underframes look like that. the end here. I got lettering there. Uh, I don't know if you can see it, but um, the, there's lettering up here. And that can be read. I don't know if you can read that on the camera, but you can read that in real life. Uh, and here's this side. I'll set that back down on the track here. The couplers look nice. At first I was a little skeptical because they didn't have the little thing that drags down, but it's kind of cool. And also, they uh, uh, supposedly they rotate, so if you have like a rotary dump thing, they would be able to rotate on those. Just more detail. Um, like I said, they're heavy, so I mean, they're nice though. The one thing I don't like is, unlike some cars, uh, here, let me pull my... Uh, Oh, that's a good example. Um, one second. Like this one, the Southern Pacific. This coal car ro rolls pretty well by itself. Um, so there's a smooth roll in there. These, if you push them, they don't really roll very far. They stop pretty quick. I mean, they move, but... Uh, They stop pretty quick, which uh, if you don't have a very powerful locomotive, that just means that it's going to require more power to get it moving the way it is. But um, for me, it's not a problem because I, you know, four by ten, wait no, four by twelve, which is the layout I got here. This is four by twelve, uh, one four by eight sheet. I see right here, it uh, splits, and there's a four by four right there. But, um, so yeah, it's not a problem. I'll pull my Athern uh, SD60M up here to show you what they look like. It's the green BNSF color on these cars, uh, but uh, I think it looks good. I actually kind of like the green. It goes really well with the uh, Heritage 3 of um, BNSF, although it looks good with Heritage 2 as well. Uh, on the internet, you from Walther's, you can order coal packs to set on here, and I'll probably do that eventually. 
um, to make so it looks like you have a full coal load. Uh, for what I paid for them, I'd say it adds a pretty good um, you know, car. Uh, I don't I don't know what word to use, but it makes it look like you have a pretty full train. I might get one more set, and then it'll match up perfectly when one comes out the tunnel and the other one goes in. See there, it goes in. And it waits a little while to come out. But, uh... They're pretty good. For the price, it adds a good length to your train. Well, there's that with the new scenery I've done. Do one more run by here. So, uh, like I said, on Walders this December they got them on sale. They might have them on sale next. I don't know how long they usually keep this kind of stuff on sale, but it comes like this, and they're pretty nice. I like them. So, that's my review of the uh, Walders Gold Line Beth Gun Coal Porters. Thanks for watching.